Hi everybody, this is Connie, and I am back with you with a the third installment of my Mercy Thompson series by Patricia Briggs. I, if you want to know any more about Patricia, I will put her um, information that I filmed on my first video down in the down bar. And this, we're going to be talking about Iron Kiss today. This is the third novel in her series about Mercy Thompson. Okay, and let's read that about the book. It is Iron Kissed. Iron Kissed, the third bird book in the Mercedes Thompson series, focuses more on the Fae. The werewolves, of course, as Mercy's family, whether she wants them or not, also have a major role, but the vampires are conspicuous by their absence. The reason for their absence is that the events of Iron Kiss take place in less than a week, and because I had enough to juggle and the vampire situation Mercy has put herself in is going to require more than a brief appearance will answer. Like most of my books, this one held a lot of surprises for me. I had intended for Mercy to choose her men in this book, but I didn't expect it to happen the way it did. I also found out a few things I didn't know about some of the characters. It made me like some of them more and others less. It also made me realize that one of the terrific things about writing a series is the ability to get to know more about the bit players. In a single book, or even a duology, there are only so many pages to develop characters, and I have to restrict myself to only a few. A series is not so restrictive. That is all that I have on this book. So this is going to be a very short video. But... Really, guys, if you if you love werewolves, if or shapeshifters, if you love vampires, if you love uh, fairies, etc., this book, this series is for you. This is one of my all-time favorites, and I just completely reread it because I hadn't read the last book in the series, so I completely read the whole series just to get to that last book. And I've this is like the third time I've completely read a few of these books. It's it's awesome. Um, Mercy herself is a mechanic. She owns her own garage. She's buying it from um, an old fay guy. And um, you'll get to know a lot more about Adam and Stefan and Charles and... Um, his name just escapes me right now, the other brother. <laughs> anyway, I'll let you go, and I'll talk to you again on the f with the fourth book. Bye-bye.